So just how strong is the sport of high school soccer in southeastern Wisconsin? Well, check out these numbers. All four finalists in the Division I and Division II championships are local. Add Division IV winner Prairie School and Division III champion Delavan Darien, and the sport is as strong as it's ever been in the Preps Plus area. We'll start in D2 as Cedarburg, last year's runner-up, takes on Brookfield East, making their 17th state appearance most of any school. The Spartans had the early chances but could not connect. Here's captain Peter Raymonds on the breakaway, but his left footer is just wide. We are scoreless at halftime. Finally, in the 58th minute, Brookfield East breaks through. Raymonds with some pretty footwork as he finds an open lane, then he punches it into the corner of the net. The Spartans jump on top 1-0. Later, East gets a break. Bulldog goalie Nat Esten cannot handle this kick, and Raymonds right place, right time. It's in the back of the net. The Spartans shut out Cedarburg 2-0 for the school's first state soccer title since 1997. Our school needed one of these. It's been been forever, and I don't, it's just, I can't describe it. It's just amazing, amazing feeling. Yeah, this was our goal from the beginning. Preseason camp, Herbie says, our one goal is to win state, and that's what we did this year. That's a team effort today and all year, and I think the boys did a beautiful job. The D1 final match, nine-time champion Marquette against first-timer Menominee Falls. And the Hilltoppers, who uncharacteristically missed the tournament last year, were on a mission in 2014. After scoring in the first minute of play, they tack on one more in the 25th. Off the corner, Ted Beezer with the header as Marquette goes up by two. But the Indians answer in a hurry. Two minutes later off the loose ball, Jake Luck loops the shot over goalie Quinton Ludwig. The topper lead is back to one goal. But Marquette responds off the clearing attempt. Michael Russell hammers this ball in midair and it finds the side of the net. Marquette has a 3-1 advantage at the half. And finally some insurance in the 57th minute. Falls goalie Will Genthy with the first save, but he can't stop the follow by Alec Philippe. The Hilltoppers make up for last year with a 4-1 win. It's state title number 10 for Wisconsin's top team. We were just itching all summer, um, the whole year off, to do back here. And to be back here is just really satisfying. All our hard work paid off. No one expected this at the start of the year, but these guys did. And, and uh, you know, my hat's off to Marquette. They were, they were the best team that we played this year. Every year we're motivated. I mean, we, we know we're going to get everyone's best game. Everyone plays us like we're uh, a champion, and we have to uphold ourselves to that. And I think the guys really did that this year.